function f is defined recursively by f of 1 equals f of 2 equals 1, and f of n is equal to f of n minus 1 minus f of n minus 2 plus n for all integers n greater than or equal to 3. What is f of 2018? We're going to start by writing f of n as follows. So f of n minus 1 is the same thing as f of n minus 2 minus f of n minus 3 plus n minus 1. So that is equal to f of n minus 1. And then we still have this f of n minus 2 plus n. So we get that f of n is equal to negative f of n minus 3 plus 2n minus 1. So rearranging stuff, we get that f of n plus f of n minus 3 is equal to 2n minus 1. So now we're going to do some work on f of n minus 3 <clears throat> to come up with another equation here. So we take f of n minus 3. That's equal to f of n minus 4 minus f of n minus 5 plus n minus 3. So this can be rewritten as f of n minus 4 is the same thing as f of n minus 5 minus f of n minus 6 plus n minus 4. So that's just rewriting that. And then continuing on with the minus f of n minus 5 plus n minus 3. So combine everything there, and we get that f of n minus 3 is equal to negative f of n minus 6 plus 2n minus 7. So if we take that value and plug it up there, notice the 2n is going to be helpful for us. We get that f of n minus f of n minus 6 plus 2n minus 7 is equal to 2n minus 1. And rearranging again, we get f of n minus f of n minus 6 is equal to 6. And so that's pretty useful. So what that means is f of 2018 minus f of 2012, that equals 6, and same with f of 2012 minus f of 2006, that equals 6, all the way down to f of 8 minus f of 2 is equal to 6. So um, it's going to be true when, when we add up all of these equations. Notice that when we add up um, every equation, this negative 12 cancels with this. This negative f of 12 cancels with the positive f of 12. And so everything is going to cancel except for this negative f of 2 and the positive f of 2018. So it's going to be true that f of 2018 minus f of 2 is equal to all of these 6's added up. And the way that we find all the 6's added up there is um, we just figure out how many jumps of 6 we have to do um, all the way to get to 2018 from 8. So first, 6 times 1 plus 2 is equal to 8. And then the next one is going to be 6 times 2 plus 2 is 14. So that's the next jump by 6. Um, and 
you go all the way to 18, you can find out 6 times 336 plus 2 is 2018. And so this 336 is the number of equations that are here. So since there are 336 equations here, then this is going to be equal to 336 times 6. And we know that f of 2018, we were told earlier that f of 2 is 1, so minus 1, and 336 times 6 is 2016. So therefore, f of 2018 is equal to 2017. So the answer is choice B.